I shall warm and shall roll the first and foremost, and give our praise and glory due to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. I double honor to the apostles and the great mess one in peace to the elected nation of Israel, the one third the brothers are doing this work to in the truth. Okay, now you know I just want to get into this topic about you know um, being apt to teach. You know you need to be ready in order for you to go there in a house and a byways, you know, and teach this word, man. Okay, now the prophets of the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, you know, they all have to learn, man. Okay, and then when they were ready, you know, when Yahweh Hashim HaShah saw that it was fit for them to go out there and teach this word, then they would go, okay? So you have to be ready to teach this word of Yahweh Hashim HaShah, okay? Now, you know, I'm just going to bring out a few, uh, you know, precepts here and a few, uh, you know, my examples to show you that the Lord, you know, like he gave, uh, you know, I'm Ezekiel the word, right, the role. He told him to eat it first and then go teach the house of Israel, man. Okay, because you have a lot of people, you know, who are who are in these, you know, um, churches, you know, um, who you know claim to say this is what they believe, but they can't prove to you what they believe because what they believe or what they've heard, you know, was from their pastor, man, which is a lie. You know, for example, you know, uh, you know, I'm a Jesus being the Most High, you know, Yahweh being the Most High. The scriptures tells you that there's an order, man. Okay, it goes Yahweh, Yahweh Shai man woman and then so on and on okay now that's the order of things okay now yahawasha he's not the heavenly father man you know the whole you know i'm a trinity thing man that's false but you have a lot of people in these churches who would wanna you know i'm gonna tell you that that's what the bible says but they can't prove it so therefore they're not apt to teach okay you need to be ready in order to go out there and teach this word man okay which just goes to show you that these people they don't have the spirit of the lord yeah they're only regurgitating what they've heard from their pastors man and their pastors is only doing the same thing now the scripture tells you man you know let um you know i'm uh, you know i'm uh, if the blind lead the blind both of them shall fall into the ditch man okay so you have to follow the right leader man okay now this is the book of uh, ezekiel chapter three um i'll start from uh from from one and then i'll jump down uh you know to verse 17 okay it says moreover he said unto me son of man eat that thou findest eat this roll now this roll is the truth okay the scriptures the book okay now in the book of um let me get that precept right here this is in the book of isaiah you know the book of isaiah chapter 30 34 verse 16 it says seek ye out of the book of the lord and read okay so the book of the lord is this bible okay it's knowing it's not any other books man okay there's so many things that are added into the scriptures right but you know the scriptures tells you man you should not add and take away okay now you know these you know i'm a you know i'm a church believers and so on and on they read the new you know i'm an international version you know and so on and on right like you know all of these different you know i'm a you know i'm a you know bibles you know it's um uh, you know it's you know there's some work there's some scriptures that are added and taken away now you know the true book of the lord you know yahab you know um the closest you know one is the king james 16 11 version and then you go back into the hebrew and the greek okay but it says seek ye out of the book of the lord and read none of these shall fail now what are these these are the prophecies okay now you gotta in order to believe that you know you gotta have that faith man you know that faith is very important but then and then and then you know to prove how much faith you have is by your works man because you got a lot of people who say oh i believe but then when you look at their works their works show you how much they truly believe man Okay, if you truly believe in this thing, man, you're going to do the work of the Lord, no matter what circumstances you're in, man. Okay, because you, like, again, you got a lot of people, you know, who claim to tell you, you know, that they believe in so on and on, but their, you know, their works is dead, man. Okay, and it says, seek you out of the book of the Lord and read, none of, none of these shall fail, none shall want her mate, for my mouth it hath con. Uh, commanded and his spirit it had gathered them that's right man the prophecies will never fail okay and that's how we know this is the book of the lord man okay because every single prophecy that was spoken here in the scriptures has come to pass and you know there's more that will come to pass man as you see what's happening in the world it's slowly coming to pass man okay but that's the book of the lord now when the lord told ezekiel to eat this roll that's 
what that role is, man. These scriptures, the bitter and the sweet, okay? It says, Moreover, he said unto me, Son of man, eat that thou findest, eat this roll, and go speak unto the house of Israel. So what was the first thing that the Lord told him to do? Was to eat that roll, man. Digest it, right? Understand these scriptures, man. The Lord will sup with you. And then go and speak unto the house of Israel. You can't just hear from somewhere, you know, and then go and, you know, try to, you know, I'm going to tell other people, you know, that that's the truth, man. Okay? You know, it's kind of like, you know, when you, um, you know, um, when you don't know the information of something and then you try to tell someone else that that's what that is, man. Okay, you have to know it first in order to teach other people. Okay, it's just basic, you know, simple concept, man. Okay, now it says, Moreover said unto me, son of man, eat that thou findest, eat this roll, and go speak unto the house of Israel. So I opened my mouth, and he caused me to eat that roll. That's right. And he said unto me, son of man, cause thy belly to eat, and fill thy bowels with this roll that I gave thee. Then did I eat it, and it was in my mouth as honey for sweetness. That's right, man. And then over time, it became bitter. Okay, now when you hear, you know, um, the teachings of these so-called, you know, I'm a Christians in these churches, they only tell you about the sweetness of the scriptures because that's the only part that they've heard, man. When you tell them about the bitter, that Yahweh did not come to save the world and that he is coming back with a sword because they've never heard that before, because their pastors have never taught them that, you know, when you tell them that that's in the scriptures and even when you read it in the scriptures to them, they have a hard time believing it, man. Because they only know the sweetness of the scriptures. They do not know the better parts of the scriptures, man. Now, the Lord deals with the perfect balance, okay? The sweet and the bitter, man. You cannot take one and leave the other, man. You got to eat that whole plate with the Lord Yahab HaShem HaShai, man. It's not according to what you want to do. It's according to what the Lord Yahab HaShem HaShai wants you to do, okay? Now, verse 17, it says, Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me. That's right. So you hear this word from Yahab HaShim HaShai, and then you go and give warning, man. Okay, when you hear that word, you understand it, man. Okay, you understand it, you know, according to what the Lord wants to give you, because not everyone has the same level of faith. Okay? Not everyone has the same level of faith. So with what Yahab HaShim HaShai, you know, gives you, you take that and you multiply it, man. Okay, like just like, you know, in the book of Matthew, you know, about the five talents, man. Okay, the Lord gave one five talents, another three, and then the other one. Okay, you do not want to hide your talent. Okay, so you take according to what the Lord gives you, and then you go and you multiply it, man. Okay, replenish it, man, the truth. Okay, now, this is the book of um, Isaiah. Isaiah 62. Isaiah 62, verse, uh, verse 6, it says, I have set a watchman upon thy walls, O Jerusalem. That's right. Who's the watchman? The elect. The men of the Lord, Yahweh HaShem HaShai. You know, at first they were called the seers, you know, but now they're called the prophets, okay, because they see what Yahweh HaShem HaShai gives them, and then they go and they warn the people, man. You know, that's, you know, the prophets are the most important people to the Lord, man, okay. Now it says, which shall never hold their peace day or nor night. That's right, man. When you look at us out there in the house in the byways, we do not keep our peace day or night, man. Okay? This net, this internet is, you know, what is bringing forth the truth, you know, throughout the whole corners of the earth.